A couple of days ago, I came across just the oddest story. A woman named Claudia who was 46 claimed that she and her two daughters saw Bigfoot. And basically, the Department of Fish and Wildlife didn't believe her. They told her that it was probably just a bear or something. And she was just so upset by this, not being taken seriously, that she decided to sue them. And she also hopes that by suing them, it will put pressure on the state of California to finally recognize the existence of Bigfoot. Claudia claims that her and her two daughters ages 11 and 14 were hiking near Lake Arrowhead in California when one of her daughters became aware that something was moving in the trees. And as she looked closer, she saw Bigfoot staring right at her. So she called out to her mom and her mom said, yes, yes, I see it too. And they both just stared in total shock at this creature. Claudia also stated that there was more than one of them in her own words. I swear to God, on my life, we ran into a Sasquatch. There were two creatures that were running on my daughter's left-hand side and then ran behind the big one that was 30 feet up in the tree. My daughter actually filmed the entire trail and I don't know why, but she only filmed about 10 to 15 seconds of it. Maybe she was scared. Now I will show this footage in a second, but she also said that once this creature started to sway from side to side, they decided to leave because it looked like it was in distress. And that statement did stand out to me because a lot of people who swear that they saw Bigfoot say that it started to sway from side to side and they felt like it was getting nervous or something. And also bears do not sway from side to side like how an ape would. I swear to God, mom. Yeah. Yeah. I want to go home now. Did it move? Yes. Now I did find this footage to be interesting and I did see something that looked like a huge head. But just like most videos, it's not really clear as to what you're actually looking at. Now after the sighting, the mother placed a call to the Department of Fish and Wildlife and they did investigate, but they told her that it was just a bear and that made her very, very upset. She told a journalist that they're supposed to be there to protect the public. They're not doing their jobs. If I can save one life, it will be worth it. I realized when I saw this creature face to face that there's just so much life out there that we do not know about. Life is so beautiful and I'm wasting my years. She also added that she lost 125 pounds since the sighting and she also decided to get a divorce. This encounter motivated her to chase her dreams and to live her life to the fullest. Now she also left a message on a tree close to this location where the sighting happened, asking anyone if anyone had witnessed anything strange recently and if so to give her a call. And Claudia claims that she has gotten some phone calls about other Bigfoot sightings in this area. So if you live close to this location, I would recommend to head on out there to Lake Arrowhead in California one day with a high quality camera, because you never know. You might also come face to face with a Sasquatch and finally be the one to end this mystery once and for all. Until next time, this is Paranormal Junkie. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and stay tuned.